And now to the North Country, where 8th graders got an up-close look at higher education with a tour of SUNY Plattsburgh. Local 22's Sam Israel went along for the tour. He has more about a new program aimed at making education more accessible. The doors of SUNY Plattsburgh opened to about 100 8th graders from four local middle schools. We see North Country students as being the future of the North Country and certainly help to raise the essentially the economic vitality and the prosperity for the region. The program creator says many students in the North Country come from families that don't have a history going to college. For her, this mission is personal. To me personally, it's very um, heartwarming because I'm a first generation college student. My husband, the president of the university, is also a first generation college student. And so we really see the value in supporting kids that come from families that don't have a background in going to college. Things kicked off with a student Q&A. I really wanted to inspire these kids to come to SUNY Plattsburgh because it is a great place to be. Other events included campus tours, a pizza party, and even pictures with mascot Bergie. Games were also played. Julian Garcia is a grad student in education. He hosted a game where eighth graders picked ping pong balls out of a bucket that contained either negative or positive comments. They would throw it in the negative, in the trash, and they would say, get it out of here. For Garcia, this game represents life. He was the first in his family to attend college, and he believes it is more important than ever to eliminate negative self-talk. We tell ourselves, especially as first gens, um, that we can't get into college. You know we have families who are financially struggling, and I think that's super important to remind yourself, things like, I'm strong, I'm brave, I'm capable and having that and carrying your own agenda and pushing that forward to really remind yourself that you do have a place in anywhere in the world that you feel fit. And he sees a lot of himself in his younger students. I saw college as something that was so far reaching. None of my family had ever been to college before. I come from a family of immigrants who had migrated to the States in hopes that they can actually send one of us to college. Now he's hoping to inspire the younger generation. Having someone who's been in those shoes really motivates you and say, hey, look, I'm here, you know, I've done it, and you have the power to do it too, to shape your own narrative. Honestly, when the world tells you no, just push back on that idea and you make it a yes. After the tour, the Plattsburgh State President presented certificates to the eighth graders that invite them to apply to the college after graduating high school. Now, these young adults may have a long way to go, but they may one day find themselves walking through the doors of Hawkins Hall. Reporting from Plattsburgh, New York, I'm Sam Israel.